Hi everybody, uh, welcome from Brittany. I'm currently on holiday in France, so the nature of my posts are going to change for the next two weeks, just so you're aware. Um, because I'm holidaying, I'm not going to be doing as much content uh, with images and, and text, but I'm going to do some videos for you because I'm in the Celtic uh, region of France called Brittany, uh, and it's one of the Celtic nations. So the Celtic nations uh, include five places in the UK, Scotland, Ireland, Wales, Isle of Man, and Cornwall. Okay, so that these regions contain all the Celtic history and culture and mythology, obviously, which I'm interested in. Uh, and so do two regions in Europe, which is uh, Brittany in France and Galatia in Spain. So whilst I'm here, I'm going to teach you a little bit more about Celtic mythology, uh, including an origin myth I've discovered recently. One is from uh, Scotland, so it's Gaelic, and the other one is Gaulish, so I'm from France. It's a fascinating myth. It's an origin myth, which means that it explains the origins of the cosmos in Celtic terms. And I've never come across anything like it before. Because if you read uh, the Mag Mabinogion from Wales, or you read the Irish cycles from Irish mythology, they don't really have uh, an origin myth. They've got an idea, a sort of a vague idea of this origin. But the one I've come across, absolutely fascinating. It's very similar to the myths I've been explaining in uh, my series, Tales of the Monomyth. So I'm going to introduce you to that, explain a little more about it, about the person who has uh, published it online. I'm going to try and find this person and see if they can uh, prove that it's a real, a real origin myth and that he hasn't reconstructed it from past stories. If it's authentic and genuine, it means that uh, I found an extra piece of the puzzle to help me put the monomyth back together, which is really exciting. So I'll explain more about that later in the next week or two. And for now, um, I'm going to show you a little bit of uh, traditional Brittany dancing uh, by the Britann people. It's, uh, again, hundreds of years old, this culture, and uh, this, this dance, I, I couldn't quite date it, but it's 1800s, 1700s, so uh, I'm going to introduce you to some of it now. Follow me. <laughs> 